Hi, I'm Scott from Sellers Massage and Body Work, and I'm going to give you a little bit of an anatomy lesson today. Um, we're going to be talking about these suboccipital muscles, tiny little muscles in the back of your head that attach to your skull and then to your neck. The primary job is to move the head, rotate the head on the neck. So, like that. No neck movement, just the skull on the neck. If um, you've been watching our videos or if you come to see us, you might have heard the term upper crow syndrome, which has a couple of different characteristics, but the important one with this is a forward neck. If you have a forward neck, your line of sight is down, and your suboccipital muscles will work all day long to bring your line of sight up. They're short, they're strong. The ones that continually work because of this type, type of condition tend to get painful, um, headaches, sore, sometimes trigger points that might give you um, some sensation in the rest of your face or head. Um, so this is very, very, very common, especially here in San Francisco with people working at desks. Take a look in the mirror. See if um, this is you. Forward neck, backwards rotated, head, headaches would be a major part of it. We have videos on our YouTube channel that can help counteract this. If it's chronic, why don't you give us a buzz and see if we can help you here in the studio. Again, Scott from Sozo Self and Body Work.